ask if she's ever been flashed? Well, yeah. Baldur's Gate 3 has added jiggly physics for your dick. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I actually I actually think this is really funny. Uh, I think this, you know, so where are the they balls have some. At, uh, Show them. Well, I, I can't. We'll get kicked off YouTube for showing the balls, right? You know Rumble that. exclusive. Reacting to Baldur's Gate balls. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> I, I did try to find some on YouTube and it, it oh. didn't work out very well. Um, I also tried to find them on Twitter and that worked out even worse. Um, mm. But <laughs> I will say this. I think it's funny because when you have a game like, I think of like DOA Beach Volleyball. Do you remember that game, Razor, from back in the day? Dead or Alive Beach Volleyball? Uh, I, I remember it. I never played it, but yeah. Okay. That, that was a game that when you talk about j jiggly physics, man, that was a, um, that was like the whole selling point of that game. Yeah. The yeah. I do remember the, the ads on TV were like all about bounteous bosoms, just jiggling and jaggling all over the place. You know, speaking of bounty and bosoms, we have some other a... um, topic later on to discuss about that. I put oh, it in the document, oh, good. Craig. <laughs> Can't wait for that. Is it about mine? Is it... Okay, sounds good. Thank they're you. not. They're not razor fists. No, they're not. No. But like I said, I, I have no problem with adding dick physics if you're, you know, if you're gonna have a game that is built around you know, and games that have have uh, you know bouncy bouncy boobs and have the ability. Like, why not? You know, hey, this is this is fine. You know, th there's all sorts of jiggle here. Put the jiggle everywhere. I think that's funny. I think it's great, and honestly, kind of harkens back to uh, you know the mid two thousands, which I have no problem with. So, it's, what I don't get is stealing? it doesn't. It's they're not in the game for any reason. Like that, <laughs> right? What gameplay reason is? You, do you need your meat and two veg flopping in the breeze? Like what? I don't under. I never understood that. And there's love scenes in the game, I guess, but they're like. Cinemax after 1 a.m. love scenes like you're not you know what I mean you don't your crank is not brought into play folks it's an inactive participant you know so I, I don't get it I would say the I, apparently you can play as you can be naked in it right and yeah. I think the, the best the best use would just be busting out the old helicopter you know, getting, getting, right. getting yeah. <laughs> or just lagging back and forth, just going Pulling a Ric Flair. Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> That's a deep cut right there. Oh, yes. Yeah. Did, 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 didn't he say he did that on the plane or something? He would yes. get on an airplane and yes. do the helicopter. <laughs> yes, he did. Apparently, he is hung like a mastodon. Really? Yeah, apparently. Good for, good for, good for Ric Flair. Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. Oh, Blabs, you're pretty sheltered. Have you ever, uh, you ever been exposed to somebody doing that? Did you just ask if she's ever been flashed? Well, yeah. <laughs> I think this is an important question. Is it not? I don't want to answer this on the internet. Thank you. Come yeah, again. she's a girl on the internet. What do you think? <laughs> well, I mean, I, I think that I guarantee, Blabs, you've had things show up in your DMs that probably shouldn't be there, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not saying to do it. Check. Don't do it. No, no. Just don't do that. Otherwise, you're out, like big time out. But I'm saying, like in public, has anybody oh, in have... public? Yeah, that's what I mean. Besides, in public, like general public, before the guy, you know, with the trench coat goes aha. No. Yeah, yeah, something along those lines. No, no, no. I can't okay. say I've been flashed that way. I mean, I don't mean to like put you in an uncomfortable. Spot. <laughs> you sound I'm disappointed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, sadly, think... I haven't fulfilled I've that. I've never been long flashed ever. by the trench coat man. Right. <laughs> man the trench coach the trench coach guy uh, that's like when you think of creepy dudes like that's yeah yeah like, right dude right. in trench coat going out with the with the incentive of uh with the whole intention of just opening it up and helicoptering and, uh, that's crazy man that's crazy stuff and i'm glad i'm glad that yeah. that what uh, would you, the, blabs if that happened what would you even say apart I'> from I'd probably just laugh Mr. in his face because it probably was really small <laughs> probably like, oh, you have a mic for an ike <laughs> right well see here's the thing though you guys are you guys are like ah oh, cringe craig here's the thing it's all up here because we're going to transition to the female equivalent of the helicopter here with this next Be story careful with that word transition right now <laughs> that's true my fault um <laughs> there was another twitch streamer this is from this guy kai um there's a twitch streamer party trick <laughs> which is pretty funny 
And Vlad's, Vlad's brought us this story. This is the female equivalent of the uh, of the helicopter here. This apparently is what's happening on Twitch. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. This is what this this is what happens on Twitch, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm just saying I have been exposed to the female version of that now. Just saying it's it's not a it's a thing. So and by exposed you mean actively sought out and possibly paid for. No, Blabs brought it to us. <laughs> of course she did. That's right. <laughs> what? I helped the men out. I'd be like, really? listen. Boom, so you go. Look what I got. Uh, Look what I got for you. But what do you think about this? Leave us a comment down below. We read every single one of them. Also, make sure you hit the subscribe button because you have found your home for common sense in the gaming and entertainment worlds.